Russia's first new production 2160 Blackjack, in decades, makes its maiden flight updated. Russia has flown a first example of the 2160M Blackjack strategic bomber from the new production batch. Full-scale manufacture of the variable geometry bomber and missile carrier, which was developed toward the end of the Cold War, had ceased by 1995. After that, only a handful more were completed using existing components, before Moscow decided in 2015 to relaunch production in the upgraded 2160M form, primarily as an interim measure due to delays in the PAKDA new generation bomber program. The first newly manufactured 2160M took to the air today, Jan 12, at the factory airfield of the Kazan Aviation Plant, which is owned by Tupolev, the aircraft's design bureau. Both those entities now come under the umbrella of the United Aircraft Corporation, UAC, part of the state-owned Rostec entity. The new 2160M was flown to an altitude of over 1,960 feet and was in the air for around 30 minutes. The crew of test pilots of Tupol of PJC performed maneuvers to check the stability and controllability of the aircraft in the air, the statement added. The story of the Blackjack's production relaunch began more than a decade ago, when Russia began work on the secretive PAKDA, expected to be a subsonic, stealthy, flying wing design to replace the current manned bomber fleet. This program has been dogged by delays and limited funding, and in 2015 the decision was made to resume series production of the 2160 and postpone the PAKDA. The decision to restart the Blackjack production line was announced by the Russian Minister of Defense, Sergei Shoigu, in April 2015, during a visit to the Kazan plant. Formal order for 10 new 2160 MS was then signed at the Kazan plant in January 2018 in the presence of President Vladimir Putin. At the time, the unit cost of each new bomber was put at around $270 million and the first example was expected to be ready in 2021. Russian Aerospace Forces have declared a requirement for at least 50 new build to 160 M aircraft, although so far no further orders have been placed. 17 to 160s make up the current Blackjack fleet. Since the original Blackjack is long out of full-scale production, the effort to restart the line at Kazan has not been straightforward. In the meantime, however, the existing 2160 has been subject to an upgrade program emerging as the 2160M. At one point, the new build aircraft were to be designated 2160M2 to differentiate them from the modernized aircraft. In the event, the commonality between the older, upgraded jets and the new batch means they are both somewhat confusingly designated 2160M.